Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, it's the final round of the season for the Junior Championship. Of course, Tyler McAlpin is your champion. He's not racing in this race here. So a big chance for the rest of the grid to find themselves an opportunity of a win. Aman Ganatra is on pole position. Teddy McPherson in second. Then we've got Caden Harris, who's actually not made the grid by the looks of things. Phoebe Cake and Benjamin Bartlett on the second row. We're off and we're running. We're down towards turn number one. And Aman Ganatra has not got a good start here. But who will get the whole shot? But it's actually going to be Benjamin Bartlett. Teddy McPherson finds himself in second spot. And Phoebe Cake is in third. So Ganatra from pole. But the looks of things is not even getting going at all. So the front three separated by very little and Benjamin Bartlett well he's someone who has won already got himself two round wins this season he's actually almost managed to finish in uh, second four times this season looking to add another winner make it three from the season Teddy McPherson his best performance so far this season is one second position he's managed to be third twice could potentially find himself equaling that best performance if he is to stay where he is and actually fun fact he's actually a track owner and you can see the track on the back of his car for Teddy McPherson how do I know that well he actually followed me on Instagram and I've checked all the information out it's a fair play so Phoebe Cake is just about going to move up to second position so Teddy McPherson comes through the Joker and actually this is going to cost him a load of time so that's a bit of a silly decision he's going to find himself behind Phoebe Cake and Phoebe Cake moves up to second spot and it's just really it's Benjamin Bartlett, a bit of a free opportunity. Bartlett, who started fifth on the grid, up to first, and now with a very sizable gap to work with, through the devil's elbow. Now we're heading up Harry Hill, who's, man who's managed to get the better exit, up towards the North Bend, out of the two of them. And it looks like Phoebe Cake, though, runs very deep there. Teddy McPherson does not need a second invitation, takes the inside line, has the overlap, and as we come down towards the paddock bend, I think you're fine. Phoebe will probably take the Joker here. Yeah, Phoebe does come through the Joker. McPherson will take second position. Already Jokered, of course. But the chances of winning this race have becoming very slim indeed due to the time loss and the battling there. So it looks like Ganatra, yeah, is a lap down. So there's only three cars able to take part in this race. Harris, Caden, who is starting in third position did not start the race and actually Ganatra is going but is a fair chunk of time down actually almost a lap down will probably lose that lap this time around so ganatra has got some issues with the car that is a fact but one person who does not worry about that is Benjamin Bartlett a very sizable lead now and this will sew up second in the championship he will end on 155 points he'll finish 11 points behind McAlpin Ross McAlpin not racing in this round. As we once again head through the paddock bend, across that start-finish line. It's been a phenomenal season. Again, it would be very rude as sold yet. Ganatra is going to park the car on the outskirts there of Tanadega. And Ganatra's race is done. It's probably done off the start line, to be honest. It's definitely an issue. That is for certain. So getting a lovely look here then of Teddy McPherson's car. Trying to chase down Benjamin Bartlett. But again, it'd be rude not to mention Tyler McAlpin, who is the champion. has been so, so good. At the start of the season, it looked like it was going to be a battle between himself and Ty Gratton. But it then became a battle between McAlpin and Benjamin Bartlett. And Benjamin Bartlett was equaling McAlpin. If McAlpin wasn't winning the round, Benjamin was winning. And if... Benjamin wasn't winning, McAlpin was winning. Those two have been absolutely phenomenal. Benjamin Bartlett looks like he's going to take the spoils of this round. The championship going to McAlpin, so very much looking forward to seeing what they can both achieve. Teddy McPherson has become faster and faster and faster as the season has gone on. And he is looking down the barrel of equaling his best result of the season so far. And then Phoebe Cake who has not managed to get on the podium all season. Actually, to be fair, has got three times finished in fourth spot. Phoebe Cake is looking like a podium winner for the very first time in the season. And the Cake family will be very, very happy indeed. So Chris Cake, who 
Williams taking part in the Swift Championship. Matt Cake in that car this weekend. Sharing cars around within the family. Still managing to get podiums. Fair play. As we're on the last lap now. Last time round for Teddy McPherson over the jump. How committed are we? Oh, yes. Big old jump. As we now head through the devil's elbow the Teddy on the side of the car. But here is your race leader, the number 444, the bright blue, the electric blue. As we now head down towards the paddock bend for the very final time of today's race and the very final time of the season. Benjamin Bartlett with merely a chicane to go, picking up his third round victory of the season and confirming second spot in the championship. Teddy McPherson will pick up second in this race and third in the championship and then Phoebe Cake with her first podium of the season congratulations so here's confirmation of your results then Benjamin Bartler first but first and second Phoebe Cake third Ganatra is a DNF and it did not start with Caden Harris <laughs> 